praise the Lord. Hallelujah. God bless you so much for always joining. My name is Arietta. I always say this program is authored by the Holy Spirit. Even I, apart from reading the Bible, I don't know what the Spirit is going to say through me. But the Bible says He has given us the ability to know what to say at that same hour. That we should not think about it. Hallelujah. Let's dive in. Ezekiel chapter 40 verses 14. He said, He made also post of three scots cubits, even unto the post of a court round about the gate. And from the face of the and from the face of the gate of the entrance unto the face of the part of the inner gate were 50 cubits. That is Ezekiel's vision was still on. And there were a narrow windows to the little chambers and to their posts within the gate round about. And likewise to the arches and windows were round about inward and upon each post were palm trees. Then brought in me into the outward court and lo, there were chambers and a pavement made for the court round about. Thirty chambers were upon the pavement and the pavement by the side of the gates above over against the length of the gate was lower pavement. Then he entered the bread from the front front of the lower gate into the upper front of the inner court without an hundred cubits eastward and northward. With all these details, men, Ezekiel can only just be intelligent. Our God is intelligent and he has created us in this image. Anything that God has created us to be, that is how he is. He's so, so intelligent. And God, being a God of, um, he, he, as in he creates what he is. So, anyone that is saying that you are not intelligent does not know who your God is. But I want you to pray this prayer that, Father, the knowledge I need, the insight I need in this earth to bring out that purpose that you have placed in my heart, that intellectual ability that is out of this word, Father, Lord God Almighty, grant unto me in the name of Jesus, because I know you are the God of perfect knowledge. Father, you, your spirit is in us. Therefore, it bears witness with us that we are your children. Father, in the name of Jesus, help us to understand, assimilate things perfectly in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, Lord God Almighty, for your love, for your mercy, because we are even able to read this Bible verse and know that anyone you use it, you, you, you justify it. And anyone you justify it, you glorify it. Father, thank you. We give you glory because we are being used by you daily and all that you have placed in our hand. You will give us that ability to be able to bring them to pass in Jesus' name. For in Jesus' wonderful name, I pray. Amen. Our God is a great God. God bless you so much. Share, subscribe. Let the word of God go out there.